it just never stops. It just keep going. I don't know what's going on here. It's just, I can't stop scrolling. It never ends. Tjena, I'm Ludwig Niedebach and welcome to another video on my channel. First timer, go and subscribe to it. Something really amazing just happened or it's been happening for the past few days. I don't know the feeling, the feeling is weird. You know you're posting stuff to Instagram and YouTube and everything and you kind of tell yourself, I'm not doing all this for views and likes. When you're proud of something, you want to show that to the world. And it's just a weird feeling when like, everything just like start rolling on. Of course, we don't do it for like, when you take a photo, you don't take the photo because you want the likes. Like, uh, you take the photo because you're passionate about what you're doing. But if you didn't care at all, there's no reason to post it. Because you're posting stuff because you want people to see it, because you're proud of it. You're proud of your work. So two weeks ago, I made a reel that looked like this. I get the camera, I take the photo, I edit the picture and I post it to Instagram and then I cry because no one sees it. So I got this sound from Chris Howe. I've been following him for, since I started pretty much, since I started taking photos. And when I got my first camera, uh, he was one of the first ones that I started watching on YouTube. He taught me a lot from watching his videos. And lately he's been posting most stuff about the algorithm and how to work around it and work through it. This sound wasn't used a lot when I used it. so. It hit something, hit that sweet spot. It had some magic in it. I added uh, an outside element to the to the reel. Nothing special. I posted it. I'm all happy about it. Just like, oh, yeah, I like this. I don't. I didn't expect it to get it, like gain anything. I just did it because I liked it. It was fun. I, I tried to make it a fun thing. Uh, it's been two weeks. I haven't noticed anything. It got maybe around a thousand views. Nothing more. Fast forward to like two days ago when likes started to drop in. I was like, okay, uh, this is weird. As we speak right now, it's almost at 200,000 views and like 14K, 15K likes. It's been saved and shared over 2000 times. It just got from like nothing to like, this. it gives a special feeling of motivation to like create more stuff. As I said, you don't do it for the likes, you do it because you like it and you're, you want to be proud of your work. So therefore, you post it. If you didn't care at all, you wouldn't post it. it that's lying to yourself. We do it because we like it and we do like we create stuff because it's fun. If you didn't care at all for your photo, for a video you made that you're proud of, if you didn't care at all, you wouldn't post it. You would just you would just leave it on your hard drive and just let it be there, which I've done to some photos and some videos. I filmed it, I took the photo, and after that I just left it. Uh, I saved it to my hard drive, and it would never see the daylight. The algorithm on Instagram is kind of like unpredictable. There's no real right and wrong, I guess. You can follow trends, you can do, like post stuff from videos that are, you can use sounds, you can use photos, you can use hashtags that are kind of like viral, you can use them. But in the end of the day, I think it's just pure luck. This video that I posted two weeks ago gained a little bit of a viral, I would say. Two weeks later, it will eventually like die off and end up just, yeah a video in my feed. But it gives that special motivation that it is possible. We're not gonna lie. It doesn't matter who you are. As soon as something that like you're proud of get noticed, you will be happy. I'm not gonna lie, I'm fucking thrilled. And it gives me that little motivation to like, I wanna do more, I wanna create more. I've tried to be more original with my things. I try to do more of what I think will be funny. I want to post whatever I want to show. I've been posting on a lot of reels from our, our trip to Norway. If I'm posting them, I want people to see them because it's something I'm proud of and I'm really happy we did that trip. But the conclusion is that the algorithm is unpredictable. You never know what video or what photo that will show up. Just keep grinding and sooner or later, it will hit that sweet spot. This will come to an end, but it happened once it can happen again. I want to try to accomplish that. I do this because I like taking photos, I like creating stuff, and things I'm proud of, of course I want people to see it. And anyone who says anything different is a liar. That's it, go and subscribe to the channel, and hopefully I'll see you in the next video. All right. <laughs>